Hey everyone, so I'm filming another video and in this video it is an eyeshadow testing video and I'm testing this one. It is the new iHeart Revolution Revo Pooches palette and it actually has different dogs on the back. So the first one is Biscuit and then this is Coco and then this one is Bruno and Blondie. And I have a feeling, could be based on the ones that I see in their office. I swear it is. And then it just looks like this. It's so soft. And these are the shadows. And I'm going to do an eyeshadow look with it. So I will be back in a second to start off the eyeshadow look because my camera's flashing, which means I have to change. So I've pulled you in a little bit closer so we can get up close and personal with this eyeshadow look. And I'm going to start with this shade Rollover. Wow, if you could just see how much fallout came out of that pan. It was a lot. I'm scared now on my eye. Oh, wow. Okay, let's clear this up quick. I, this is one of the most pigmented palettes I've ever used from Revolution. Wow. Okay, I even think I have to blend out the edges with this one. I'm going to use this shade Biscuit here just to blend out the edges because that was a very dark transition shade for me. And just kind of lighten it up a little bit instead of making it look like dog crap. I'm going to use a fluffier brush and just blend out all the edges because I feel like it is very, very <laughs> pigmented. I'm going to go in this shade here called Bark and just put that on the outer edge. Again, I'm going to be very careful because I've just dabbed it in once and that is the pick. Ooh. Okay, they have upped their games with their form. Wow. Okay, let's do that on the other side. And we're going to do a halo eye, so I'm going to put that brown on the inner corner as well. And I'm going to take woof in the centre of the eyelids. I'm going to take this dark blue Bruno colour just to blend out the edges a bit more because I feel like it's so bright but the contrast is just off. And then I'm going to take Pawsome just to blend it out a little bit more. And for the lower lash line, I'm going to go in with Biscuit and then I'm going to go in with Rollover. And now I'm going to go off and do my mascara and come back with swatches. Okay, let's find an inner corner highlight, and I'm hoping there is one, because in a lot of palettes, I can't find one anymore. Oh! Let's use the first shade here called Walkies. So this is the first row, as you can see, very pigmented. And this is the next row. As you can see, I've swatched really badly there. So yeah, let's get into the review part of this video. I'm not really that... I don't know, I love the packaging. The packaging has sold this palette to me, but, sorry. But I'm just not keen on the new formula in this eyeshadow palette, I don't know why. Like, the, the glitter shades are very, very crumbly, to the point where, if you can see, it is all over my cheeks and I'm not really happy about that. I do love the overall eye look. I feel like it looks grungy. It's different. Um, and I do like that. But I'm just not happy with the formula. The mattes. Oh my god. I love the mattes in this this palette though. The mattes kind of trump it. So you could just find a, a shimmer in another palette. The mattes are amazing. Like They work very well on my eyes. A bit too well. <laughs> But you can blend them out and yeah, they look so much better. 
but yeah it was very hard to use the shimmers very hard but I feel like I need just a little bit more practice with this palette and the new formula and I'll be able to use it and um, I really kind of like the look that I came out with like I didn't know what I was going to do I didn't know I wanted to do a halo eye which I'm not sure how well you can see how well it's translating on camera because I feel like it's just a mess <laughs> to all my other eyeshadow videos but yeah um if I was to give this a rating I feel like I should give this a rating so there's so, so many pros and cons I'd give it a 7 out of 10 um just because at this point in time I think I need to learn how to play with it a bit better but yeah I do like these eyeshadows and again here is a little look at them I love for the packaging overall I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10 because how can you not <laughs> so I hope you guys liked this video and enjoyed it please subscribe down below for more videos from me and I'll see you soon bye guys